good morning friends uh, today I am here to show you uh, how to fetch the array list one by one yes, this is a very weird thing and uh, this is the problem which is created because of the set material by name and the problem is that when I am fetching the names set material by name get material slot names it is fetching all the names in an array written value is array so we cannot change this thing so uh, that is one of the biggest problem uh, for which this code looks very untidy and very dirty it's not untidy it's very dirty i cannot uh, properly regenerate or recreate it in a very nice understanding way i will get into it slowly so when i am creating uh, fetching the values of the names of the of the each of the names of the of models material names material slot then uh, each it is putting them in an array list and we can see that list uh, when we will uh, when we are we are roaming here and we can change material and if I hit it so there are four of them wall ground ground wall B so this is uh, it is uh, showing up because I have made this code and I have appended all of them and put it them put them into a single uh, output string so that is one is that's why that is printing out all the names so what I have done uh, I'm showing this video because of Dhyanithi key uh, Dhyanithi K I don't know this person he is uh, following my channel and so and he has asked for it so I'm making it again so here what I have done I have put the number of I have fetched the number of variables in the array list uh, that is after that is I am creating after uh, it is created so I am cr after this array is created then I am fetching the length of that array into this number of math so I can fetch each of those values one by one so what I have done primarily I have set this number of math and I have put number of math into number of math so this one is 4 primarily currently now and I am uh, setting it to be 4 again in the, fr uh, in the first set and this is the first time and this is the only time I am running this code so and then what I am doing then I am uh, subtracting then I am subtracting this thing uh, from what then I am subtracting 0 from it so this is 4 4 minus 0 is 4 and a number of math is also 4 so 4 minus 4 is 0 so first uh, in the array we have we get the 0th position so to get the 0th position I have used this code and after and and I am getting the name of the array at the 0th position from this thing so it is putting that name into the first slot material slot name 1 and so and now it is it has become its 4 now right so it's putting the 0th value here so next what I have done I have I am putting I am subtracting again 1 from number of math so now it is 4 uh, it, it is 4 now uh, and I'm subtracting one from it so it, it is becoming three so I'm subtracting four from three and getting one and then I'm getting the value of the second position that is the first place in array there is zeroth place zeroth is the first one one is the second one and that is how it goes and this is how it has moved further uh, into here and and that is how uh, that's why when I'm incrementing this thing uh, uh, it is fetching me the next value in the array list so this is how it is uh, fetching me the sec a third last value sorry th and this is and this is how it will do the next one also so now we have three over here no we have four over here we haven't changed it so number of then we haven't set number of math to anything again so it is four so we are subtracting four minus two uh, so 2 minus 4 so this one is first happening 4 minus 2 
4 minus 2 2 2 4 minus 2 again we are getting 2 so that is the second that is the uh, third value uh, third position of the array and then we are having 4 4 minus 4 minus 3 is 1 4 minus 1 is 3 so that is the last position of the array so because I know there are only four array slots so I have uh, copy pasted it four times and if you have more then you have to go uh, and then you have to just copy and paste this thing and you have to just add one more to this to get the all of the values in the array so this is the dirtiest part of the code and the second dirtiest part is this thing materials the material list uh, the coolest thing of this uh, of this function is we can create any material set material parameter by name and we can and if we promote it to a variable then we can change all uh, very easily the every connected thing so if i want to change it and if i want to make it a gold or anything there are thousand materials in the list and sometimes we can download lots of materials from the uh, marketplace which are for free or you can purchase it also the materials we can change this material like very easily by changing this thing and i have crisscrossed it i have connected it very criss in a crisscross way so so when i play this thing let me show you what is happening when i'm playing this thing when i am playing this thing if i change material it's changing up all of them in an arbitrary way because i have crisscrossed it so and and i have used this and I have promoted all of them into variables so I can change them very easily so I can like write silver uh, lamppost silver not I don't like lamppost silver I just I want simplest silver silver uh, okay let me go metals and uh, metal uh, let me go first gold gold so if I use it in the gold and if I just compile it and, and then I hit save and then I can again start playing uh, change material see gold is over here and it's crisscrossing itself to the various positions so that is what's the purpose of this uh, up, uh, promoting it to the variable so I'm stopping it over here and I'm re again returning to the here and this is it this is it and I have nothing more to demonstrate over here and you have to use this dirty code uh, if you are if you have to fetch array names one by one every of them in a in, in an un when you need all of the output names in separately I haven't found anything else or I might be a newbie or I might be a stupid person to do this thing or there might be a better way I have tried things but I haven't found out how to get that thing if you found it out please enlighten me and that is what it will be and thank you and I will say uh, Danity K thank you because because of you I am posting it other would I wouldn't have because I am a lazy person and that's it and I am showing you everything so if you just want to copy paste it you can copy paste it in your programs ok let me go slowly The, uh, this is the whole code and here is the code which I was trying to change but it didn't work let that 
be in the next one when I will do when I will show you how to change uh, this in, in a more cleaner way if I come to that if I work in on it again thank you